Real quick guys, before we get into the video, I got a stocking stuffer alert for you guys. This deal right here is gonna be good until December 15th of 2017. Uh, if you got a player that wants to work on their hand-eye coordination, these mini gloves are great to do that. You're gonna get two of them and a dozen of the mini wiffle balls for $20 flat, no extra shipping, $20 no matter where you are in the United States. Just click the first link in the description box below and there'll be more info there. Let's get into the video. Hey Coach Madden, my name is Brian Ochoa, I'm from Phoenix, Arizona. Uh, now that the winner's here, I wanted to know if there were any hand-eye coordination drills we can work on, even though if it's still dark outside. Brian, thank you so much for that question. That's a great question, and you're right. Winter is upon us, but before we get into the video and I give you that answer, go ahead and give me the thumbs up if you think hand-eye coordination is very important for baseball. If you think hand-eye coordination doesn't matter at all, Give me the thumbs down. Tell me you don't need that hand-eye coordination. You just need speed and power for baseball. No matter what you just hit, go ahead and hit that subscribe button with the bell notification right next to it if you're serious about becoming a better baseball player because that's what I'm going to help you do on this channel. And this way you'll be notified every time I upload a new video. So Brian, you're right, man. Winter is upon us. Days are shorter. Nights are colder. It's not great baseball training weather. You are in Arizona, though, so I, you know, I can't imagine it gets too horrible. But for some of those guys up north, it gets very, very cold. But you said dark as well. Let me tell you a quick story. I was just watching UFC 218, Aldo versus Max Holloway last night. I'm shooting these on Sunday. Um, but there was a girl on there who was from Puerto Rico who was fighting. And of course, Puerto Rico got hit by the hurricanes and she didn't make any excuses. She had the headlights from cars turned on to get her training in during the night, okay? So first of all, darkness is not an excuse. Not that you're, I don't think you're looking for an excuse. You're just looking for uh, ways to work on your hand-eye coordination. But don't let darkness be an excuse for you. Don't let a place or cold or anything like that be an excuse for you. The guys who really want it are going to find a way. And I think you're one of those guys, Brian. Um, and that was a great question again. So here are my tips for hand-eye coordination drills that you can do pretty much anywhere. Uh, of course, you do need some light, but you can do these inside. So cold is not a factor. The first of the hand-eye coordination drills is gonna be working with mini wiffle balls. These things are great because you can do them anywhere. You can do them inside. Now, if you saw the beginning of this video, you know that there's these uh, mini gloves that you can use as well to work on catching these things. You don't really need those though. You can go and get some of these uh, uh, wiffle balls anywhere, really Target, Walmart, um, any local store probably carries some of these. Um, and you can work on your hand-eye coordination. These things are great. You could throw it against the wall and try to catch it, throw it up and try to catch it, or you can use a personal pitcher pitching machine and have them shoot at you. Now, you can hit these balls, um, you can catch these balls, you can do fielding with these balls, and you can do them anywhere. I shot a video actually doing this in my living room, so there is no excuses to where you can do this. You just need at least the mini wiffle balls, and then of course, if you wanted to add in the gloves or the machine, that would be even better, but really all you need is this. The second hand-eye coordination drill that you can do pretty much anywhere is called ball drops. And you're just gonna need a ball that will bounce when you drop it. This is a lacrosse ball. You can use really anything, a tennis ball, any ball that's gonna give you a little bit of bounce when you drop it. And all you're gonna do is throw it out in front of you. You're gonna need a little bit of space for this, but throw it out in front of you and you're gonna run and try to chase it before it hits the ground again. Now, I did a video where I did this with a partner. Your partner could stand out in front and drop it and you run and go get it. But you can also do this drill by yourself, okay? In a small area. You do need a little bit of area, but it can be a small area, okay? All you're doing is working on your first step quickness and your hand-eye coordination because you got to make sure that you're catching this ball while you're going full speed in a short distance. The third drill you can do to work on your hand-eye coordination is just going to be taking that same ball and throwing it against the wall and working on your fielding, okay? So you're going to need a wall for this one, a wall that you can throw a ball against. Don't make don't do it in your dry on your drywall in your house. It's got to be like a brick wall, maybe in a garage or a basement. I don't know how your basement is set up, but make sure it's a, a wall that you can throw a ball against. And then you're just going to be working on your fielding. You could also turn around backwards, throw the ball at the wall, and then spin around so you have to react quicker and then field that ball with good hands. Okay, so that's another great hand-eye coordination where you don't need much space. All you need is a wall and a ball, um, and you can get in some good hand-eye coordination work. Again, if you guys want to take advantage of the stocking stuffer deal, you're going to get two of the mini wiffle ball gloves and then a dozen mini wiffle balls so you can work on your hand-eye coordination. Um, again, this deal is 
good until December 15th, 2017. And you just got to click that link below uh, in the description. I'll also leave another link to where you can get one of those machines uh, at as well if you're interested in that. But again, these are great stocking stuffers and I just wanted to offer you guys that deal. So I hope this video helps. Thank you so much. That was a great question, Brian. Um, keep putting in that work and I hope to hear from you guys soon. I almost forgot the 100,000 subscriber giveaway contest. Now, if you're interested in winning one of anything on my website for free, shipped anywhere in the United States of America, there's two ways to get your name in here and your chance to win. The first way is to send me a question on video. Take your phone, record yourself, uh, record yourself asking your question, and if it's a good question and I use it in a video just like this one, your name is going in here and you're going to get your chance to win. The second way to win is by answering the trivia question in this video in the comments below. And the question for this video is, on what date did I upload my best backhand drill video? Leave your answer in the comments below. I'm going to pick one of you guys as the winner for this video and your name's gonna get put into the 100,000 subscriber contest. When we get to 100,000 subscribers, I'm picking a winner. If you haven't already, go subscribe, click right here. And then also I want you to go check out this video. It's a good one, you're gonna like it and you're gonna learn a lot. Check it out. Here we go, catch. Catch. <laughs>